Hey guys, what's up? So in today's video I'm gonna show you how to get this makeup look and despite having this color, it's a very usable makeup that you can adapt. So if you wanna know the result, keep on watching and let's get started. I always start with a toner to glaze in my face, but this is optional, of course. I'm spreading the moisturizer in this case. It's important use a specific moisturizer for skin type, okay? I don't have an oil skin, so, but I like to use this one from Make More. It's very good for oil skin. I'm gonna apply my foundation with my brush. And I'm using a medium coverage because as you see, I need some coverage here. <laughs> but this is optional as well. I like to use a brush because it's faster and it's more practical for me, you know. Now I'm using the sponge just to remove any marks that the brush may have left. Now I'm gonna highlight some parts in my face, especially in the center. Why? Because when you are talking with someone, you look at the center of his face. Right here. You don't need to make these marks <laughs> that I'm doing. You just need to apply and blend it out. It's optional. I'm gonna make some contour on my face and the contour I say that you need to analyze your face sharp and which the points you want to bring some depth you know I want to make little by little So I prefer to make like this little by little because I avoid to make very dark. This way it gives me a natural contour, you know, just some shadows in my face. I changed the brush to contour my nose but I also don't go too dark. I go little by little. So, little by little. I'm gonna use blush. I'm gonna mix this one a little more pink and I apply on my cheeks all oh, too much but I like to use cream blush because I I can to blend this product until it diffuse it completely I'm gonna use a powder now. The mine is running out, by the way. Oh. Okay. With a 
fluffy brush all over my face. Under my eyes I like to use a brush like this because I can reach the corners here. Moving on the eyes, I've already applied concealer and all my eyelid, okay? And now, um, I'm gonna apply this shade here. It's like an orange brown, you know. And with this brush, fluffy brush, and I apply around my crease. I use soft movements because as it's my first shadow I want a more diffuse finish so blend 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 Done. Uh, now I'm gonna apply the shade here. It's orange, and I change the brush for a smaller one like this. I because if I use the same brush, um, I will lose the gradient. You know, because the darker shade uh, will rise to previous color. So it's important to change the brush when I use a dark shade. So I'm going to apply in my outer corner. Very orange. And first I'm dabbing this shade. And then I blend at the edges. But my movements are soft as well. I'm gonna go back with the previous color and the previous brush to give a finish right here just a little bit I'm gonna apply this golden color right here on my eyelid. It's a beautiful color. Perfect. I can use my fingers too, but I prefer the brush. <laughs> and I forget to say <laughs> this palette eyeshadow is for from Chicken. It's beautiful. I love it. Now I'm gonna make an eyeliner, a not too big eyeliner, by the way, because it's not my style. And 
I'm using a gel eyeliner, okay? In the brush, it's very important here. I'm using a small brush. It helps me to make a thin eyeliner. I don't have to explain how to make an eyeliner. You have to practice. Just like that. Okay, now I'm gonna apply this shade of green, very beautiful, it's a cream product, okay, and I'm gonna apply on my inner corner and also in my waterline, just a little bit. As I said, you can adapt. This is optional, of course. I don't know if I use this one or this shade of blue. What I do? <laughs> and I set this product right here. I'm gonna apply highlighter below my eyebrows. And on my face that I forgot it about. <laughs> Okay, I've already applied mascara on my eyelashes and now I'm gonna use false eyelashes Okay, I just comb my eyebrows. I don't feel like I need to apply something in my eyebrow Okay, so that okay for my lips um, I'm gonna start with this product here it's the same that I apply it right here okay but you can use concealer lipstick lip pencil what you have okay so first I'm gonna make the contour of my lips
I forget to say to you, <laughs> I applied a concealer in the center on my lips, okay? And I just mix and I created this gradient. But that's all, guys. <laughs> what do you think? Let me know in the comments your opinion and what's the next inspiration you wanna see here, okay? If you join, I like it, by the way. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button, okay? So that's all. Bye-bye.